Okay, it looks a little gloomy back here, doesn't it? But uh, actually there's a reason it's gloomy because I'm under a stand of redwood trees that are probably in excess of 300 feet in height. These weren't here, these weren't put here by accident. These have grown here over, oh, at least the last hundred years or so. I'm continuing, and I've been doing a series on Robert Ripley because I think he's certainly a renowned Santa Rosan who not only lived in Santa Rosa, but he was actually born in Santa Rosa too, raised here and was buried here as you saw his grave. This, I told you, I would feature as one of Ripley's, believe it or not, and at the t after he died, the city of Santa Rosa wanted to find a way to commemorate its native son, and they thought, what better way to commemorate Robert Ripley's life than to go ahead and try to create their own, believe it or not, which they did. This church that you're looking at, believe it or not, was built entirely out of one tree. Now, obviously, we're not talking about glass, but this is a full-size tree, and a, a full-size church, excuse me, and the distinction of this property and this church is that it was built entirely out of just one single redwood tree. And you can see this is not a small structure here. And as we come down the side, you can see lights inside the building. And when I first moved here in the late 1980s, this property had fallen into tremendous disrepair. But they did put the money into it to use it and develop it as a wedding chapel and a meeting place. So I think you'll agree that it turned out very, very beautifully. And it's really a nice tribute to Robert Ripley the famous animator and cartoonist and author of this series, believe it or not. Uh, but I think it's quite a fitting tribute uh, from the city of Santa Rosa. And I, for one, am glad that they did the right thing and found a way to renovate and restore this building because it really, really turned out beautifully. So I've hoped you've enjoyed this uh, series about Robert Ripley, who's certainly a noteworthy and... Uh, uh, an American whose uh, contributions to American life and the American way of life are absolutely renowned. So thanks for being along today. I really enjoyed having you and nice comments and thumbs up are always appreciated and I'm always happy if you subscribe.